Welcome, my friends. My name is Miss Yvonne, and I'm so excited to be here with you today. We get to talk about one of my favorite things, which is dinosaurs. Is, one of, is it one of your favorite things, too? It might be. So, as we start today, we're going to do a finger play, and I'm going to ask you to take out your two fingers so that you can do the finger play with me, okay? All right, so get your two fingers out, and we'll start. Two big dinosaurs stomping in the trees. One drinks water, the other eats leaves. All done with water, all done with leaves. Now go home, go home, go home, please. Did you like that? Let's do it one more time, okay? Get your fingers out. Two big dinosaurs stomping in the trees. One drinks water, the other eats leaves. All done with water, all done with leaves. Now go home, go home, go home, please. <laughs> Good job, you did it, that was super. Well, I'm excited because we get to do another great dinosaur thing. We have a wonderful book about a mama dinosaur and her baby dinosaur. There's mama, there's baby. And the name of the book is Mamasaurus. This book is written by Stefan Lomp, and we're so excited to get to share it today. All right, here we go. Babysaurus lived in a wild jungle with Mamasaurus. He loved to sit high on her back, eating tender leaves. But one day, he slipped. When Babysaurus dug himself out of a pile of leaves, he could not see his Mamasaurus anywhere. But Babysaurus did see Ornito running by. Hey, wait, he called out. Have you seen my Mama? Does she run faster than the wind like my Mama? asked Ornito. No, she is not very fast, answered Babysaurus, but she can take huge steps. Sorry, I have not seen her, said Ornito. Then she took off running again. Babysaurus roamed through the leafy jungle until he met Tritopa. Have you seen my mama, Babysaurus asked. Does she have a long horn like my mama, asked Tritopa. No, but she has a wonderful long neck, answered Babysaurus. Then no, I haven't seen her, said Tritopa. Sorry. Next, Babysaurus saw Taro sitting high in a tree. Can you see my mama from up there? Babysaurus called out. Does she have wings to fly as high as the sun like my mama? asked Taro. No, she does not have wings, answered Babysaurus, but she is taller than the tallest tree. Oh, said Taro. No, I have not seen her. Then she flew away. Babysaurus heard a rustle behind a bush. It was Tiny Hespero. Have you seen my mama, Babysaurus asked. Mm, is she about this big like my mama, asked Hespero. No, she is much bigger than that. She's the biggest there is, Babysaurus marveled proudly. That is really big, replied Hespero, but I have not seen her. Then he shrugged and bolted away. Suddenly, Babysaurus heard a loud noise. Could that be my mama, he said? It certainly was not. It was Rexy. Excuse me, have you seen my mama, whispered Babysaurus, opening just one eye. Rexy said, does she have sharp teeth like my mama? No but she grabs the young, yummiest leaves from the highest branches for me, said Babysaurus. Leaves, yuck. I could never eat leaves, sneered Rexy. But then Babysaurus heard an even louder noise. It was his mama. There you are. I was searching all over for you, she said, giving Babysaurus a kiss. Let's find you something to eat. Do you notice that little Rex is running away? Rexy. Um, a salad is also nice from time to time, whispered Rexy as he rushed off. I think maybe he thought that Babysaurus' mom was way too big. 
Hooray, said Baby Soros. You are the best Mama Soros in the whole jungle. And there they are. There they are. That was a fun story, wasn't it? I like that dinosaur story a lot. So I'm excited because we get to do a really fun dinosaur song. And this dinosaur song is going to need clapping and then stomping. So we're going to clap and we're going to stomp. So we'll go clap, 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 clap. And we'll go stomp, 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 stomp. Okay? Will you help me with that? All right? Then we're ready to go. the dinosaurs marching marching we are the dinosaurs what do you think of that we are the dinosaurs marching marching we are the dinosaurs we'll make the earth flat we'll make the earth flat we'll stop and take a rest over in our nest We'll stop and take a rest until the end of the day we'll stop and take a rest over in our nest We'll stop and take a rest, and then you'll hear us say... <coughs> well, we are the dinosaurs marching, marching. We are the dinosaurs. What do you think of that? We are the dinosaurs marching, marching. We are the dinosaurs. We'll make the earth flat. We'll make the earth flat, and then we'll roar. Let me hear you roar like this. Roar! Cause we are the dinosaurs. All right, you did a great job, and that song was so much fun. Did you like it? Yeah, me too. Boys and girls, you've been wonderful today. And it's been really, really nice to get to be with you. I look forward to seeing you next time. So parents who've been listening in, we just want to invite you to sign up for an e-card. You can do that by going to lvccld.org and there will be instructions there. The nice thing about that is then you can stream music and movies and videos to your device at home for free. Everybody, thank you for coming and we look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.